seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. YouTube, what's going on? It's Fuse here, um, and I'm playing Call of Duty Ghosts, and I have to say, this game is fucking amazing, and I'm going to turn up my uh, sensitivity just here a little bit, sorry, excuse the pause screen, but um, in my own opinion, this game is fucking tank, it's so much fun, it's difficult, it's loud, it's obnoxious, I got my first ever kill right then, and then I got a 9 and a 8, it's just, there is no forgiving the Unforgiven, it's just, this game is insane, I have to give Infinity Ward props, I personally, um, I like both sets of multiplayer games, Infinity Ward and Treyarch, but they just take the biscuit with this game. Any game that sets itself aside from the cast and really brings its own take of, you know, uh, multiplayer to the general community at large now because let's face it everyone is kind of a cod player now um you know something has to be said about it so this game for example you need to be able to switch up your play style you can't be playing like you were playing in call of duty black ops 2 or in modern warfare 3 or you know anything they've had before because this game is difficult it really is difficult everything feels it feels like you're wearing concrete boots, there's no jump shot, there's no drop shot, there's a slide shot. And I don't know how I didn't pick up those two kills there. But I'm playing on a hardcore. Um, I haven't found an option for turning off aim assist. I don't even know if aim assist exists in this multiplayer. I don't think it does. There's no kind of snap on shot. But uh, yeah, just this game just absolutely blows my mind. Now, I haven't played as much as other people on my friends list so far. But... Already, I can say that I, I'm going to love this game for the next year. I'm getting the season pass. I'm going to make sure that... Nice long range kill there. I'm going to make sure that I have all the maps. You know, I'm going to try play more competitively. Uh, do game battles. Do anything that I need to do just to make sure that this game gets smashed out. Um, so, I just want to give you a little insight to my playstyle as a whole. I like to rush. I don't like sitting in an area, I don't like waiting for the enemy to come to me, I like to run in, kill a few, and get killed. And I genuinely cannot do this in this game right now. I have to be a lot more cautious. I get killed, I think, in a second by a guy I don't even see. I have to be a lot more cautious about what I'm doing. I have to check corners. If there is one criticism right now about the game, it's the fact that the maps are essentially massive. They are incredibly large. I don't know what the hell that's about. Infinity Ward, bring out more maps, smaller maps. Like that map that, um, back at, oh, I can't even remember, uh, PAX East, whatever the fuck it was, with Optic and uh, all those pro players, uh, Rambo Envy and all those guys played at, uh, at then, whatever the fuck that event was called. Um, that map is amazing. I've played that map once today. We were playing same, you know, hardcore kill from farms. Um, um, we loved it. It was so fast paced. I went positive by a lot. Um, I got good kill streaks. I checked every corner. Like I said, I played. I got to play my A game, rushing around, doing my stuff, you know. But big maps like this, I just can't get the grips with. There's too many lines of sight, you know. I like running around with an SMG. Um, I like running around knife only, you know, I don't really genuinely stick to what everyone else does. Um, I like being different, I get killed here I think. Um, but yeah, see I didn't even see that guy. I heard him, but I didn't see him. Um, but that's neither here nor there, that's probably just bad gaming on my part. Uh, but yeah, this game is just amazing. This the The audio in the game, if you're wearing a Turtle Beach headset, for me right now, and I have X11s, Although quite old, um, still in my opinion, uh, the one of the best, you know, um, professionally gaming headsets you could buy at the moment, and they're they're, they're cheap enough now. Um, yeah, the the audio right now is a little bit strange. You can't tweak individual settings like you can in a Treyarch game, but you know, you're kind of tit for tat. Like I've heard a lot of people complaining about uh, 
stuff within this game, and I have to say, I think you're all fucking wrong. I th I just think you're all a bit spoiled by now, by you know the developers giving you everything that you want. So, you know, for, for a change, um, let's just stop the bitching and <laughs> let's get on with playing the game. Because, to be honest, if like let's not let's not pretend that just for a second that just because you're going to complain about the game that you're not going to play it because we all know you're still going to play it. You know, every everyone everyone wants to be that, you know, pro player and get great at things and just keep playing. But I don't know, I I, I genuinely can't see a lot of you sticking this out if if you're going to keep going the way you're going. Now I'm looking outside the map there and I didn't even know. So that's a fail on my part, but remember, this is my first time playing this game. Um so look, I tried to jump, I tried to jump and duck and dive, and nothing happened there. Um, if, you ha if you've yet to play this game, you you will see what I mean eventually. There there is no jump shot, and there is no you know dive to prone, and there is no uh, drop shot, you know from Modern Warfare uh, Three or Modern Warfare Two or even Black Ops One. I was a heavy drop shot player in Black Ops One. Um, but yeah, I. I have yet to rack up a considerable uh, kill streak in this game. Again, I haven't played it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go smash it out now in like two minutes and just keep playing it. But uh, I, I, guys, I just, I just love this game. Um, everything about it—the look, the feel, the guns. You know, uh, I haven't gotten my dog yet. <laughs> I've used a soul kill streak a while. Every time I get to I get close to the dog, I get killed. Um, but I haven't gotten the dog yet. But uh, I I don't necessarily need to use the kill streaks. I just I like look. See what I'm doing now? I'm just I'm getting my feel for the game. I'm checking everything out. Um, okay, that was nuts, right? This guy kills me. How he took hit markers on hardcore. By the way, I play hardcore. This is hardcore kill confirmed. No mini map. Extra bullet damage. Less health. Um, and all that good stuff. And how I didn't pick up that two piece there is beyond me. Uh, but anyway, um, yeah, I, I, I feel right now I don't need to be playing great games. I just want to get get used to the game. I want to get the the feel of this game back. Um, I've been playing Modern Warfare 3 for the last week, and I have to tell you, this feels nothing like Modern Warfare 3. You know, if you're going into this game thinking that just because you were good at Modern Warfare 3, you're going to be good at this, uh, I hate to break it to you guys, it's not going to happen. Um, it just doesn't happen. That's just the unfortunate truth. Um, but anyway, that's the end of the game. I went, what's that say? Uh, 13 for 18 or 15 for 18 or something. You know, quite good. Not the best. You know, first time on. And that's just a quick sneak peek at the new kind of uh, auxiliary view. But anyway, guys. Um, if you're new to my channel, you know, leave a sub. Um, comment down below. Let me know what you thought of the game. Um, a like wouldn't go astray. Um, I was playing with Paraplegic Gimp. Uh, I'll sub his, I'll link his channel in the description. That's my brother-in-law. He's all the way over in Australia, so he had to like quit out. He had horrible connection. But um, yeah, leave your game tags and stuff down below, and we'll smash this game out. Um, I'm gonna have some more videos out over the next couple of days, and then I'm gonna have some Extinction gameplay out, and I'm just gonna do that whole YouTube thing with a game and be really YouTube cool. So yeah, anyway, guys, as always, just remember that 90% of men suffer from worms in the wrinkles of their ball sacks, so you need to remember to keep your balls clean, squeaky clean. Adios.